welcome back. So we're going to be doing a quick unboxing of the Captain America Hero Pack. So this is my first Hero Pack that I've bought for this game. Um, hopefully we get a few more. Let's see if we can open this. Alright, so there's a piece of tape across. Alright, we got it open. Alright. So inside, we got, oh, nice little poster. Captain America. Um, ch -ch -ch, little overview. So Captain America is leadership. This is an aspect that his deck has. And then let's get to the cards. Alright. So we will go ahead and open these up. <clears throat> Should have brought some scissors or something. Alright. So we got our alter ego and hero side for Steve Rogers, Captain America. Alright, we'll just go through the cards in the order that they have them set in. So Steve Rogers has a recovery of three, hand size of six, 11 hit points, and his living legend ability reduced the resource cost of the first ally played each round by one. And then his other ability is during setup. Um, search your deck and discard pile for Captain America shield, upgrade and add it to your hand. And then shuffle your deck. So on his hero side, he is Captain America. He has a Thwarted 2, Attack of 2, Defense of 2. Pretty balanced. Um, his I can do this all day action. Discard one card from your hand to ready Captain America. Pretty nice. Alright, now the Captain America cards. We got Agent 13, which is um, an ally. Thwarted 2, Attack of 1. She has a Health 3. And her response after Agent 13 enters play, remove two threat from the scheme. Okay. Fearless Determination. We got two of those. And uh, cost zero as a hero action. Captain America gets plus one four until the end of the phase. And draw one card. Okay. Heroic Strike. One, two, three of those. That card costs three and it as a hero action, you deal six damage to an enemy, and if you pay with a physical resource, you stun that enemy. So yeah, I like that. And then we get shield block, two of those. Um, it has an interrupt, cost zero, and when you would take any amount of damage, exhaust Captain America's shield to prevent all of that damage. That's pretty nice. Then he has a shield toss. Another card using his shield. Um, as a hero action, discard X cards from your hand, then return Captain America's shield from play to your hand and deal four damage to X enemies. Okay, there's two of those. Then we have Steve's apartment. As an alter ego action, you can exhaust Steve's apartment and draw one card and heal one damage from Steve Rogers. Captain America's helmet. When Captain America would be defeated, set his hit points dial to one instead, then discard this card. Okay, so it's like an extra life. Captain America's shield. Um, restricted, max two restricted cards per player. And Captain America gets plus one defense and gains retaliate one. Okay. Super Soldier Serum. Um, you can, as a resource, exhaust Super Soldier Serum to generate a physical resource. And there's two of those, and they cost two. Alright, so now to his leadership cards, it looks like, for his deck. We got Falcon, um, which costs four, Thor of two, attack of two, and health of three. Response, after Falcon enters play, look at the top three cards of the encounter deck. For each treachery, look at this way. Remove one threat from a scheme. 
and then Hawkeye. Okay, so this is like the same as the one that came in the core set. Um, cost three, Thor to one, attack of one, three health, and then Hawkeye enters play with four counters on him. And after a minion enters play, remove one error counter from Hawkeye, then deal two damage to that minion. Squirrel Girl, cost two, one Thor, one attack, two health. And after Squirrel Girl enters play, deal one damage to each enemy. Not of allies like that. And then Wonder Man costs two, Thwart of one, attack of three, three health. And then his attack has a star next to it, which means this ability has an additional cost for Wonder Man to attack. You must discard one card from your hand. And then Avengers Assemble costs four. He's got three of those. Uh, max one per round. As a hero action, ready each Avenger character you control until the end of the phase. Each Avenger character in play gets plus one thwart and plus one attack. Okay. <sighs> Make the call. There's two of those. That's a card we've seen in the course set as well. As an action, play the printing cost of an ally in any player's discard pile and put that ally into play under your control. Pretty nice card. Strength in numbers, cost zero. You can exhaust any number of allies you control and draw one card for each ally exhausted this way. There's three of those. There's two power of leaderships, which we've seen. You can have two per deck and double the number of resources this card generates while playing paying for a leadership card. And then we got one Quinjet. So after your turn begins, place one time counter on Quinjet. Cost one to put it out and then and as an action you can put an adventure ally from your hand into play with printed cost equal to or less than the number of time counters on Quinjet. Then discard Quinjet. We get three of those. We get another Mockingbird. It's also from the core set. She costs three, Thor to one, attack at one, three health, and after Mockingbird enters place on an enemy, then our resource cards, energy, genius, and strength all produce two resources when paying for other cards. And you can only have one per deck of each of those. Alright, so Avengers Tower. If each of your allies has the Avenger trait, increase your, increase your ally limit by one. And then as an action, exhaust Avenger's Tower and reduce the cost of the next Avenger ally played this phase by one. And then we have Honorary Avenger, three of those. So play only if your identity has the Avenger trait, which Captain America does. That's why this is in his deck. And then attach to a friendly character. Attached character gets plus one hit points. And gains the Avenger trait. Okay. And then we have his, so that's his deck that he comes with um, that they suggest for him to use. And then his obligation is Man Out of Time. You get to the Steve Rogers player, and then you may flip over to Alter Eco form and then choose to exhaust Steve Rogers and remove Man Out of Time from the game. Or you can discard um, half of the cards in your hand, round it down, and discard this obligation. Okay. And then we got his nemesis. So the side scheme is Hit Squad. So when revealed in player order, each player discards the top card of the encounter deck and takes one damage for each boost icon discarded this way. And this has. Three threat per player added to it and acceleration icon. And Baron Zemo is his nemesis. Scheme of one, attack of three, five health. He comes in with quick strike. And while Baron Zemo is engaged with you, you cannot thwart. Okay, and then the other three nemesis cards would be Hide two Hydra soldiers. Scream of uh, one, attack of two, four health. It has guard, and then when defeated, deal the engaged player an encounter card. Those, and then one hail hydra, which says when revealed, each hydra minion engaged with a hero attacks that hero. 
and each player who has not was not attacked this way search the encounter deck and discard pile for a hydra minion and puts it into play engage with them then shuffle the encounter deck if it was searched <coughs> so <coughs> excuse me so this card um just says stop basically all the cards we gave came, went through already is the captain america deck so the rest of these cards are just bonus cards that the hero pack comes with. So we got some aggression cards. Um, three are enraged. So you attach to an ally, max one per ally. Attached ally gets plus two attack and takes plus one consequence consequential damage after it attacks. Three followed. You attach to a side scheme, max one per scheme. When attached scheme is defeated, deal four damage to an enemy. Okay. Three expert defense. This card says cost zero. As a hero interrupt, when your hero defends against an attack, it gets plus three defense for that attack. And then three enhanced awareness for basic cards. Um, Use three mental counters, so exhaust enhanced awareness and remove one mental counter from it and generate a mental resource. Okay, so those are all the cards that came in the Captain America Hero Pack. Um, I'll be doing some gameplay videos with him to see how he is and see how C. Rogers does and some of these villains from the corset. Alright, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe and have a great day.